Without an agent in Los Angeles, you can't get the good union work. And again, I want to you know, stress that the good union work is what I'm trying to get for my people. Uh, because you can get non-union work on your own, there's no doubt, but the rates are not nearly as good and you can't really make a full career out of non-union. You Listen, people can do okay, don't get me wrong, but you really need that union money and you get pension and welfare, you get the pension, you get health care. So working union has huge benefits and you can really have a career and then a life after your career through the pension. So they need that good union work that I provide as well. You know, anime has really um, kind of exploded with the streaming services, with anime doing so well in, in all the different areas. Now, the, the rates aren't as high, but um, it's really cool work, really cool productions, and you can get yourself to those conventions and, and sign for money at conventions. Uh, so definitely anime. I mean, interactive in general is really big right now. AAA video games, even indie developers. Um, it's just really hot. Animation is doing really well. Um, it's not a new avenue, but the volume that's going on is definitely new. I, I can't say it's the golden age of animation, but it's the golden age of volume of animation. I've never seen so many scripts for animation interactive like we see now. Um, you know, 10 years ago, if I had 15 scripts, it would have been 13 promos and commercials, or well, a lot of commercials and promos, maybe 10 to 13, two or three would have been interactive or animation. Now it's completely reversed. If I have 15 scripts, it's 13 animation and interactive and two commercials or promos. So it's, a, it's an interesting time in voiceover. It's really cool. It's kind of an, a reverse situation uh, in voiceover for managers and agents. Believe it or not, the agents are kind of the ones in voiceover that have their arms around the client and really guide them. And the managers are really there to add extra value through different relationships. So um, as you said, the, the norm is like if an, a, an actor has a barbecue, so to speak, the agent has to show up, but the manager is supposed to help clean up after it's over. In voiceover, it's kind of the opposite. Uh, the manager has to show up, but the agent stays and cleans up afterwards. Um, and I'm okay with that. I like that. I like being um, the one that they all count on. I, I, I love that, as a matter of fact, that, that my clients know that they can call me for anything. Um, even the clients that have managers, they call me. If they have a problem, they call me. They don't call the manager. And if I need to call the manager, I might. But um, so managers in voiceover are extra value. They hopefully have relationships with promo houses or trailer houses um, that we don't have. So it's a, it's a great question because it is such an interesting dynamic with voiceover compared to normal on camera and literary. That happens all the time. Um, uh, well, you're first you listen to what they say, figure out why maybe they didn't read on it. Maybe I didn't get that project. Unlikely, but possible. But sometimes they have to trust my opinion. If I didn't put them on a project, there's usually a good reason. Now, I'm a human, I'm not a robot, so sometimes good actors get missed on projects. That's just the way it goes because the volume is so heavy. But a lot of the times I have to, I know what they're looking for. And that's one of the reasons they come to me. There's a reason why I'm one of the only people to get these auditions is because I vet that. I make sure that only the right people are on there. I don't send 25 people on an audition. I send 10, I send 12, I send 15. And believe me, I have a lot more actors than that on my roster. But um, for each project, I really don't believe that I have 20 or 25 people that are right for it. So um, that's a tricky balance to be completely honest. But uh, it's a case-by-case -case basis. Sometimes I'll say, you're right, you should read on that. Here, read it. And a lot of times they book it. 